you want to create youtube videos or any other videos which involves narration or voice recording but you do not like to record your own voice then today's tutorial is for you CapCut has text to speech feature which converts any text into the recorded voice so instead of voice recording you can insert the text into your project and then generate the voice for the text many online text to speech services or even software charge money for it so i think it is one of the best feature inside a free app like CapCut so let's get started with today's tutorial. For this tutorial, I have already created a small project using the images from the Pixabay website. If you want to download those images, then the link is in the description. Let's preview the project. So as you can see, the boy and the girl character appear on the screen one after another. So there is nothing fancy I have done. The very first main layer is nothing but the background image. Then if I tap on the overlay button, there are two images, one for the boy, one for the girl. If I select any layer and then tap on animation, tap on in, then you can see I have selected the slide up animation. So that's how the animation has been given to them. For text to speech feature, you need to obviously add the text first. So I will move the playhead till the boy appears and let's say I want to do a introduction like for the boy hi I am Jason and maybe for the girl like hi I am Anna for that tap on the text button at the bottom tap on add text then write the text which you want click ok and while the text is selected at the bottom you can see there is a text to speech option so tap on that it will open a new window at the top you will see languages the first one is english and the second one is deutsch or german obviously depending upon your country or location these options will be different if i tap on the deutsch there is only one voice which is weiblich stimme so basically female german voice maybe in the future they will also add male german voice and it makes sense to choose the correct language depending upon your text language so let's say you have written something in German, then it is better to select the German voice because then the pronunciation will be correct. If you select the English one, then the pronunciation will be wrong. We do not have any German text, so we will go back to the English and let's check all male voices because we are introducing the male character. Hi, I am Jason. Hi, I am Jason. Hi. I am Jason. So as you can see using the text, the voice is being created and the pronunciation is also very correct. Tap on OK button and then it will generate the audio for you. So if I go back, you can see the audio has been added here. Let's go back again. Select the text because we would like to change the styling. So go to the style and then go to the bubble i have already searched one bubble which looks great for this scenario you can select any other styling you want for your video so as the text is white color so it is not visible so go to the style then change the color to the black click ok and let's position the text and resize it Let's preview. Hi, I am Jason. So the timing and all these things are matching properly. Let's move the playhead a little bit further and we need to do the same thing for the girl. So I can simply copy this text. Then position it. When the girl is appearing. So around here it looks okay to me. Move it over the girl tap on edit and instead of Jason let's change it to Anna and again go but before that let's trim the other end and then again go to the text to speech this time select the energetic female voice hi I am Anna and let's preview the whole video hi I am Jason Hi, I am Anna. 
and that's how you can use the text to speech feature to create videos like this one like cartoon videos explainer videos or even the tutorials let's say for some reason you do not want text to be visible on the screen only voice should be there then there is a simple trick you need to select the text go to the style and there is opacity so just bring it to zero and under the bubble you can remove this bubble effect obviously click ok and if i preview it again hi i am jason hi i am anna so you see the voice is still there i think if you delete it the audio will still be there let's try that so you see the text is gone but audio is still there hi i am jason hi i am anna if you like this tutorial then please click on the like button subscribe to my channel in the description you will find the CapCut related playlist where I have included all the CapCut related tutorials which I have created till date. Then there is a second link for a light motion app tutorials if you are interested into that app. Thanks for watching. Stay safe. Stay healthy.